Hi, Khan. How are you today? It's so great to be back with you, Sissy. And I am having such a difficult decision this year whether I should go to the Oscars or go to your famous Oscar party. Um, I think that it's a pretty easy choice, Con. You're coming to my house. <laughs> Sissy, you know me all too well. I will be the first one at your party. Thank you for inviting me. But when it comes to party throwing, and something I know you enjoy doing so well, how do you mitigate the stress of being the hostess? <laughs> well, you know, I have certain methods, Con, and one of them is I want it to be an easy party, I want it to be delicious, and I want it to be elegant because it's Oscar night. So I'm building my theme this year around my King's Hawaiian starring roles. What do you think, Con? Ooh, Sissy, you got me intrigued. Tell us more. Well, he, you know, it's a wonderful fluffy and, and sweet taste that complements any flavor. And you want a variety of flavors on Oscar night to sort of reflect the variety of, of nationalities and different talents on the red carpet. So I start with, I do a, a grilled cheese slider, a, a grilled chicken slider, excuse me, with some, some roasted peppers. Cut a corner by buying that already roasted pepper from your supermarket. Break down a rotisserie chicken. You can toss it with some tiki marsala and make a, a Bollywood slider again using the King's Hawaiian. And then for my gentlemen to honor the gentlemen in their tuxedos, my tuxedo roll is a lobster salad roll. Again, something I can pick up in the deli section of my supermarket, a, a shrimp salad, even a ham salad for your favorite ham actor this year. But again, just pop them between the slices of the dinner roll or carve out the King's Hawaiian original for your best supporting dip, the first thing you put out for your guests. So lots of ways to be fun, but at the same time, be elegant and have everybody help themselves, Con. That's crucial. Sissy, I love that idea. Guests helping themselves, perfect. Let's work for the host or hostess. But uh, do you have another recommendation for the party thrower? Well, you know, I think that everybody on Oscar night wants, it comes to play, you know? So, but it's also a night to be comfortable, Con. So I like to wear, like I'm wearing a little denim shirt, with, I don't know if you can make it out, but I'm wearing my bling. If somebody wants to come, my sister likes to wear pajamas and pearls. I think that's awesome. Why not just be comfortable? But <laughs> I like that idea. But the other thing to do is, you know, go, go look at what you've already got at home. You might have a red runner from Christmas. Why not just press it and put it back out on the, the table for your buffet or the wherever you're serving up and then, you know, pop some glitter from the party store. You might even have some of these little fun celebratory decoration ideas from your own New Year's Eve party that you've got in the closet. So have some fun, and by the way, you're gonna love this idea, Con. At my party store, I just got a, a top hat and I put it, loaded it with my yummy organic, you know, uh, classic movie popcorn, and that's fun. People can sit down and have their entire own own uh, serving, and I think that that's also very health conscious. So nobody touch my popcorn, all right? You know what I'm saying? Oh, and how I love having my own popcorn, too. Thank you so much. I'll see you Oscar night, and I hope America's Sniper wins big. Thanks so much for uh, being with us. Thank you, Con.